Okay, when we're looking at this entrance slip for molar mass, the first one states, what is the molar mass of ammonium arsenite? Now, I told you, ladies and gentlemen, that if we struggle with naming, okay, if we struggle with naming, it's going to catch up with us. This is the first place that we're going to see that because how can I tell you how many moles, how, what the mass is, if I don't know how many of each individual element there are? Okay, that's going to be tough. So, probably, you know, the biggest problem I see is naming. I look at this and I say, okay, I have ammonium. Ammonium is NH4 and it's 1 plus. Now I don't have arsenite memorized, so I look at my polyatomic ion sheet, and arsenite is ASO3, and it's 3 minus. Now when we went over naming, I told you any time I had polyatomics, I put those in boxes because I know that I cannot change that or I change the compound. So when I'm looking at this, I see that I have a minus 1. I see a minus 3. My least common multiple is going to be 3. So I'm going to have NH4. I'm going to need three of those and it's going to be ASO3. So now I have named that. Look at your paper. Did you name it correctly? Okay. If not, you need to get back in here. Come in here during academic assist. We need to go over some of that naming stuff more. Now, how I do this is I just set up each individual. I have N. I'm going to need some more room here. So let me create some more room. Give me some more room. There we go. Okay. I have N. I have H. Whoa. I have N. I have H. I have A, S, and I have O. I look at nitrogen. Okay, I have 1 times 3. I have 3 nitrogens. Each nitrogen is fourteen point zero zero six seven. So my total mass by, of nitrogen is 42.0201. Okay, I'm carrying that out to four places after the decimal because my sig figs are going to come into play. Hydrogen. Four times three, I have 12 hydrogens. Each hydrogen is 1.0079. So the 12 of them come up with 12.0948. Arsenic, I have one of those. Where's arsenic? Where's arsenic? There he is. Each arsenic is 74.92. So that's 74.9216. Finally, oxygen. I have three oxygens. Each oxygen is 15.9994. So my oxygen is going to be 15.9994. Nine, nine, 
eight two. So I'm going to take and I'm going to add up these four different ones right there. I don't want you to think that's a decimal point. So when I do my math, I come up with the value of 177.0347 grams. So what does that tell me? That tells me that one mole of ammonium arsenite weighs 177.0347 seven grams we okay with this one if you missed it do you know why that's the key part if you don't know why you need to ask questions right now okay we thumbs up we good all right our second problem our second problem Okay, what is the molar mass of thiosulfuric acid? Now, probably one of the biggest things I saw with this problem on the entrance slip was naming thiosulfuric acid correctly. So I go back to my acid rules. I see, I see one or three. What acid rule is this? Number one or is it number three? Number what? Number three. Okay, there's no hydro in front of this. So this is acid rule number three. So I need to find thiosulfate. Thiosulfate is S2O3. And that is 2 minus. Now, one of the big things that I saw. Okay, am I done naming that acid yet? Am I done naming that yet? No, because I need what? Hydrogen. How many hydrogen? Two. Okay, so this is going to be H2. H2. S2O3. Now, once again, all I do is I come through and I say, all right, what do I have? I have hydrogen, I have sulfur, I have oxygen. I have two hydrogen. Each hydrogen is 1.0079. So my hydrogen is... 2.0158. Sulfur. I have two sulfurs. Each sulfur is So that gives me 64.130. Oxygens, I have three of them. 15.9994. So that's 47.9982. <coughs> Excuse me. I add them up together. And I get one one four point one four four. And I got to go back and check my sig figs. 
okay, since I'm doing addition. There, there's three places, past the decimal, four places, three places, so I should have my answer three places past the decimal, which I do have. So my answer is going to be 114.144. 4.